public message as recorded in the book of Mark was repent and believe the gospel for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. To repent means to turn from a self-centered to a God-centered life. It's to change your mind. And if you really change your mind, you'll change your ways. It's a commitment to obey God and not to sin in the future. Now we have to believe the gospel. Uh, the gospel is defined by St. Paul in 1 Corinthians 15. He says, this is the gospel I preach, that Christ died for our sins, according to the Bible, according to the Old Testament, the scriptures. And he was buried, and he rose again the third day, according to the scriptures. So we got to acknowledge that Christ died on a cross. Uh -huh. where he bore our sins. He was treated as a sinner. He became sin for us, that we might become the righteousness of God in Christ, that our lives might be changed and transformed. And the Bible says in Romans chapter 10, that if you will confess your sins and believe in your heart that God has raised him from the dead, that you will be saved. You gotta believe on the righteousness. So we gotta confess that Christ died for us, repent of our sins, and he will forgive us. And because he rose from the dead the third day, uh, he will impart unto us the gift of eternal life. Jesus called this process a new birth. He said you must be born again. To be born again is